Hi guys, uh, in this video I'll show you how to create a work file in eViews. We'll start with time series uh, data first. So uh, there are different ways to do that. So let's say we're gonna create a new work file from the scratch. So a blank work file. So as we said in last video, we could go to file and then start new work file. And then from here you can decide what type of uh, work file or data you're working on. So uh, if we start with time series data, so these will be dated or regular fre frequency data. So you can decide uh, whether it is annual data, multi uh, or, or, or semi-annual, quarterly, monthly. So let's assume we have a monthly uh, monthly data set. Let's say we're going to start from 1950 uh, to 2012. Um, you can give it a name, the work file here. Let's say time series data or time series and then once you click OK this this is the time uh, or this is the work file for time series data if you see here so the range is from 1950 uh, um, uh, uh, January the first month and till 2012 uh, month 12 which is which means December so we have a monthly data set uh, a, a work file for a monthly data set from 1950 to uh, 2012 to December 2012 so let's say now I want to create uh, the same file but rather than using the menus I want to use the command uh, uh, here so let's say let's close this one let's create a new work file so the command to do this in eViews is um, W uh, F so means work file and then write create so as one word so wf create then uh, between brackets I will specify what type of work file I want here so the work file so wf equal monthly because this is as we said is monthly data then comma uh, we could name uh, the give name to the the page so the say page equal dated so this is that means it's it's um, dated data as we say regular data and we close the bracket and then space we decided uh, we said it's monthly data so we m stands for monthly and the start year which was 1950 to 2012 uh, if you press enter now then here we go so we get the same work file blank work file there's no data yet in this work file but again the start from the first month in 1950 to december 2012 so what if you already has if you already have uh, uh, an excel sheet where your data uh, is stored and you want to upload this uh, uh, this data so in the previous video I show you how to do this for using the um, this uh, 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 open so open and then uh, we could because we didn't have a work file so we this is an Excel uh, Excel sheet so we we will use uh, foreign data as a work file and from here you can go to where you stored your data so I yeah and then you can open your 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 data that way so then choose the file and then next and then next and 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 that's it so now here we go so this is the data we have in this in this excel sheet so what if i want to to um do the same but rather than using the menu i want to use the command window so i'll close this one and i'll do it again so um in in the last time when we did this we we created a blank uh, uh, work file so we started uh, the command was work file wf create but now because we just want to open an excel sheet so it will be work file open and then um, between brackets page equal uh, page equal time series so this is the uh, sheet i want to upload okay and then close the bracket and then you need to specify where where this file is in your in your computer so the file in my computer my desktop so I'm just gonna copy the um, uh, path for this uh, file and then if I press enter here we go so it did the same exactly the same 
uh, the same thing and then finish then you have the uh, work file so in this in this video I showed you how to create a work file uh, uh, when we have time series data so as we said now you could uh, simply um, use the uh, menu to create a blank work file um, let's say go to new work file and then you decide uh, if it is a, if this time series data so it will be dated and then if it is annual or quarterly then you decide here so we decided we, we choose to have monthly data and then you put the start date and the end date and and so on so that's one way to do that or you could use the uh, command which uh, is w uh, f create and then you specify what sort of data you have then the work file is monthly then and, and you name the page and you give the range uh, and etc or you could import data that already you already have in an Excel sheet so you could do this using open from some from the menu to go to file open and work uh, and then foreign data as work file or you can use the uh, the command that I just showed you okay next time I'll show you the uh, how to uh, do the same with cross-section data and uh, panel data thank you for watching